Okay, so I've had a few of you asking different ways, how do you get rid of the magnetic timeline? If you don't know what I mean by this, it's basically when you cut a clip here and here and delete the middle, it automatically brings it up. In some, this is called magnetic timeline. It's also called auto ripple editing, things like that. There's different names for it really, but ultimately it's the same thing. So now in Filmora, I've already imported my footage. If you don't know how to do that, there'll be a card up here to show you how. And then I've already made two cuts to give me this clip in the middle that I want to delete. If you don't know how to cut this footage, there'll be another card up here telling you how. Now when I delete this, it'll automatically bring this clip over here. So now if we show it deleted, you can see that this gap is gone and it's assumed that we don't want that space there. For me, I like having this on, but what we can do is if we undo that using Command Z or Control Z if you're on PC, then we can come up to the left of the timeline and you can see this little chain link. It'll say auto ripple on. You can click it and you can see now it's broken and this is turn this off. So now when I delete this, it gives me a gap here. Now you can select this gap and delete it, but personally, I like having this on, as I find it just kind of speeds up your workflow. And if you wanted to add a gap, maybe I wanted a bit of gap here, I can select these clips and just drag them over. And now I've got a gap here, which again, if I want, I can select and delete. So playing this, it will just come over as a black screen. So thank you for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please leave a like. And if you wanna see more content like this from me, then consider subscribing and turning on notifications. So thank you for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye.